What's up guys, this is the glitch that may or may not be leading to the reason why we can't find games in matchmaking. This is just a theory, um, I honestly have no idea if this is affecting it all, but it's definitely causing some sort of problem, and I thought I'd share it, and if it's the issue, hopefully it'll get fixed. But um, the first thing I noticed is, even though I'm in a party by myself, when I pull up roster, I can see I'm the only one here, but when I do my game session, we can see it says player count one, which is me, but then the game session leader is Will Treaty, which is not in my game. He was actually in a previous game that I played, the last game I played earlier this morning. So I noticed that right there is a big issue. Uh, another way that I'm reasoning this to actually affect part of the game not working is when I actually go over to, um, to the theater, and I try to start up, let's say, a previous film, just like in Halo 3 or Reach, you can't watch films with more than one person. And this here is noticing that, well, it's assuming that there's two people in my room, even though it's just me. So I'm very curious as if this is what's preventing matchmaking from working, or even though you're queuing up with maybe yourself or only few people, it's struggling to match you with anyone because you're not actually searching. And I noticed if I go to find a game right now, anything, I won't get the gray boxes. And I'll never get the gray boxes because it doesn't think I'm the party leader. And it doesn't even think I'm searching. The only thing I could do is restart Halo by going to the dashboard and quitting. Alright, now that I'm back, if I go to multiplayer now, or better yet, if I go to roster and then I look at my game session, I'm now the game session leader and I am once again the only person in my room. If I go to find a game, the boxes appear. Now, this doesn't necessarily find a match, um, but it's definitely a reason why we can't, so should be looked at. Thanks.